the sun for much needed emergency supplies. Some residents say they lost everything in the fire. Yeah, this guys they are helping a lot because everything was burned in the house. So they are giving us some blankets, some food and some other stuff we're going to use. Residents are now demanding proper housing. But for now, they are left with no choice but to rebuild. I didn't save anything. I, everything is gone. I don't have anything now. We are rebuilding our shacks now. There's, there's no material. We're just clearing the space for the poles to be tucked in. Meanwhile, supplies meant for the cancelled Cape Town cycle tour are now being diverted to the area. So I think as soon as it was cancelled this morning, you could see straight away the organisers said, well, all of the feeding stations, all the cool drinks, all the water stations, we need to donate that immediately to the, to the victims of the devastating fire in Hout Bay. And really uh, hats off to them and hats off to Cape Town. Uh, you've just seen Cape Town have really come out in support of those people who've lost their homes and so many people lost their lives. It's really tragic. The city of Cape Town says it has plans to resettle some of the affected residents. Carmel Lochmer Roberts, SABC News, Imizamayetu, informal settlement.